uh, the witness here told me that in about a mile stretch, she witnessed the woman blow through a stop sign, run through a couple yards, and then take out two fences and hit three cars. And she says that that all happened in a matter of about 10 minutes. Now, she was on 911 with dispatchers the entire time, telling them the woman's every move. Now, two of the cars she says that the woman hit were for sale at Northside Repairables. Ironically, that's where the witness works, but they were closed. She just happened to be passing by when she witnessed this destructive ride. Today, police came back to get a statement. She tells us the detective told her that the driver suffered a broken nose and her blood alcohol level was way over the legal limit. She was extremely intoxicated. She, she was enough that normal people would probably be dead. And where did you come up with that conclusion? Based on the statement from the officer. Now, I called the sheriff's department to find out where is this case and will she be facing any charges. They say that they're turning over the case by the end of today to the prosecutor's office to review. So she might be charged or she may not be. Reporting live in Elkhart County, Judy Lykowski, ABC 57 News.